Got a question here about uh, drivers and firmware servicing. Would you recommend using the Windows Update for Business drivers and firmware tool as opposed to any other solution? Uh, and if not, what would you recommend and why? I mean, it obviously depends, as always, it depends. If you're an Intune-only customer, that is about the only solution there is that is also hardware independent. Unless you want to write scripts yourself to do the same thing. So for that scenario, it, 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 it's perfect. What I don't like about it right now is that you cannot really rely on the automatic approval to still have to do that manually. It's not that bad, but you, you have to do it because you don't really know what's going to be auto-approved. And the second is, is the targeting. I would like to have much more information about the drivers. For example, which computer model are you really intended for? So if I would open up my, my, uh, my console and Intune, um, and head over to, to drivers, Sure, I created these policies. I gave them the name by model and I sure added in my models uh, in it. But I kind of wanted to know that when I click a driver and look at that list, that the vendor also did that. I, wa I want them to tell me, yeah, this is indeed for that model. Currently, that doesn't show up in here. Uh, you can go behind the scenes and, and get some more information, but in general, stuff like that is, is currently missing. I, I hope they will add that in down the road, but yeah, we'll see. Other than that, it works most good. Oh, they can also fix the naming. <laughs> yeah, I mean, if everyone knows what... Uh, this is, right? It's uh, something. This one I can figure out is a network driver. I get that part and this one as well. And this one. And... But what these are, I have no idea. Could be AMT. Um, could be something else. Doesn't really tell me. No, and especially adds to the confusion when you see one might surmise that based on the release date and the versions, that that's actually two different software components. I'll say so, because this version in here versus this version number here is very much different. Yep. So, yeah. Uh, hopefully, they're getting there at some point. Mm -hmm. um, config man is easier. You have your package, you deploy it, done. 